Welcome to Gilux's channel and well, first of all, remember to use my creator code Gilux, and well, I owe you an explanation since, as you all know, yesterday, July 28th, Travis Scott's Utopia album came out but his skin did not return to Fortnite as I said, well, let's go in parts because the skin does not return to hear his album and Marshmallow if we confirm that Epic is racist or has a mania for Travis Scott, well. The truth is that not since Epic Games is that strange with all the skins, for example, it takes you out of Marshmallow for his Shockwave album but not for Travis for his Utopia album. It takes out countless Marvel skins that have left and returned for their movies or series and you also add DC and Flash, for their Flash movie theory that I guessed by the way. But you don't add John Wick for his movie John Wick 4 when you only took out for John Wick 3 in theory you should follow the pattern but he didn't. And for example because Kratos doesn't come back for his game God OG War Ragnarok when everyone is asking you for their beat but nevertheless you add Aloy who is from the same company and developer of video game Sony. Is what he said like that a thousand examples Epic Games brings you nonsense things for example today he took out Naomi Osaka. And soon Ariana and J Balvin who are on the app I added but and Travis Scott where he is there he just released his album. Well that's the explanation that Epic Games has and there really is no explanation because sometimes they add to skins for his event, for example, Marshmallow for his album, but then the day of Star Wars arrives and they don't add them in fact in the past if they did, that is, like one year they added it and another not, can someone explain to me why Epic Games does that? I would say that it is because the rotation is totally random but not because sometimes if it adds skins for its events and in fact I have already said it before, well the explanation would rather be Epic Games that is. Epic is like that sometimes yes and sometimes not. Now let's go to you will really come out many people believe that Travis Scott would never return to Fortnite and that his album Utopia was his last chance to come out. But perhaps the last of Kratos was not the game God of War Ragnarok no longer has dates, perhaps the last chance to John Wick was not his movie, and so many more, for this reason they mean that he will never come back, obviously not. Also the most important thing is that the CEO and founder of Epic Games Tim Sweeney said on Twitter that Travis Scott is welcome to Fortnite thus removing him from any possible blacklist and in fact all the most important Fortnite leakers talked about this so Travis is completely off the Fortnite blacklist in case there was any doubt about this it is something that I have defended for a long time and finally someone from Epic Games came out to deny it, but hey. The things where he was going that literally the founding CEO of Epic let them say Travis is welcome to Fortnite and then he also said that he did not know when he was going to return something that I do not believe because he is the boss of all Epic Games and surely manages the income of his company because he is the one who has to do it since it is the boss who was going to do it if not obviously Ollie better help him with the accounts but he must be attentive if the economy of his company is going well or not. Imagine that they go bankrupt and the boss of the company does not realize or did not see it coming it would be quite funny that is why the boss must be aware of the income. And because he mentioned all this very easily because literally if he is attentive to the income he has to be attentive to the only source of income from the most popular video game of your company, which is Fortnite and the only source of income from Fortnite is obviously the store and sale of cosmetics. So it is obvious that you have to be aware if things come out that people go to buy like Travis and that he doesn't get a lot of crap that nobody wants, so he does know, it's also the most requested and the company will earn a lot of money, but obviously he said no to avoid being asked more, it's very easy, he says, he's welcome, Bone removes him from the blacklist and then says that he doesn't know so that people stop asking why Tim made that comment and it's the best thing he could do for his company. So now that we know that he will leave after despite it didn't come out because of his Utopia album, now let's go to when the skin will come out then, well, as I said before, Travis is the most anticipated and Epic knows it, they are not stupid, so if they release it when all the Hippox Sheena leakers and YouTubers talk about him and his possible return it is clear that all the players will know about the possible return and obviously they will have prepared turkeys what happens that Epic does not really earn money there because if you recharge turkeys for Travis and keep them for a lot the time until it comes out doesn't earn so much that if, for example, you recharge for Travis, they tempt you to spend it on something else, then Travis comes out and has to recharge there, epic if you earn money, epic earns money when you reload turkeys, not when you collect turkeys for example, of the pass is that what epic wants us to reload is for that very reason that my theory is that you roll over on a random day without anyone waiting for it as it happened with the recon expert after 4 years that's why I say it in case the crazy 
One saves some bucks yes you know you won't be recharging soon as the Sora Risa could be coming very soon and in fact all the after seeing that Travis did not come out. He sure said he already spent the bucks and they do it desperately because they are surely frustrated for not having gotten the skin they wanted and had been waiting for a long time. But that only causes you to buy something out of desperation that you really don't like it and that in the end it stays in your locker eating dust. In fact in my opinion I think he's saving beloved skins like Travis Scott and Kratos for when they really need it so get it out Infobeak said it didn't come out to get it out at the end of a season and that we recharge turkeys since now we already had the turkeys ready and actually that is a good theory and that same theory that I said some time ago after the tragedy of the Astro World and that it was said that the skin would no longer return, well. I really think that Epic will do that with the most beloved skins Christos Travis Scott Stranger Things surely as it happened with the recon expert for those who don't know this skin came out one random day out of nowhere to everyone's surprise and this skin was 4 years old without going out and it was believed exclusive that never it would return to the game and many accounts were sold with it but it did not return in chapter 2 season 1 when the game was dying due to lack of updates and a season that lasted 6 months that is why a lot of attention will surely happen Plus Epic Games currently has a lawsuit from the FTC to list United States for more than $500 million that as far as I know has not yet been paid because it is awaiting a trial or such but it has already been approved that it has to pay. Said figure for what maybe Epic is saving skins like Travis, Kratos for when the demand arrives to make people recharge there by surprise. That is why Epic is surely reserving an ace up its sleeve for when it needs money and when we least expect it. That is why that if Epic puts a skin it is almost impossible to make a theory or prediction about when it could come out since it will not come out for nothing the singer does just out of conviction of the game because this was already seen when they did not release it for their album Utopia and Kratos neither for his game, well now that I'm clear, or at least I hope if you've stayed this far, keep going. You know what will happen now with the channel. I'll continue making theories because it's not on the blacklist or what will happen.